Hello and welcome. I am the Mecha Man, T H E M E K K A M A N, the Mecha Man. We are doing Destiny 2 Treasure Hunt Tuesday for August uh, the 21st, 2018. Uh, there is a new quest that is out. Uh, I actually do not know how long it takes. Uh, uh, it is called Cade's Spicy Ramen. Uh, it is probably in. Uh, of Destiny 2 Forsaken, which uh, for those that don't know, if you are looking for Solstice gear and trying to do the Solstice stuff, who knows the Solstice, uh, I saw a notification that said that it is also ending on September 4th. Um, so if you're doing the hero gear, trying to get your um, the, the ship or any other one of those achievements, i.e. You gotta level up. Uh, I think in order to get the shirt, you basically have to level up each one of those in green. Uh, but we are doing just Destiny 2 Treasure Hunt Tuesday uh, for probably, it's probably only gonna be two more weeks. So uh, let's uh, kind of keep posted there. Uh, like normal, we uh, kind of run on over. What's I don't know, you tell me, man. Let's figure some stuff out. No, nope, we're not going to turn in these journal notes. Uh, and we're not going to turn these in because I want to see what they end up turning out. Uh, I don't have anything. Ah, they updated it and it's on. You got to hit the bumper. Uh, and it is on Titan. Uh, so like normal, we're going to collect um, no refund, okay. these. Uh, we're going to collect them. And head on over to Titan. Uh, for a second there, I was like, uh, we don't have any Destiny 2 treasure hunt. Probably because of the ramen was my thought. It was like, uh, all we got is spicy ramen. Um, let's let these populate in. Uh, that looks very confined and clustered up. I like that. Uh, so for starters, we're going to hop here into this one. Uh, we're going to try to avoid the public event uh, to try and get just these... Uh, locations here um because we're doing the treasure hunt tuesday uh and it's very confined and it's on titan uh titan is a very small map excuse me it's a small map but i like that map uh for something about that titan i i truly appreciate it uh as far as the solstice goes I know I have two weekends. Uh, I have two weekends to try and get my hunter, and I believe I'm gonna have to go through and do my warlock in order to get the shirt. Uh, I it doesn't tell you how many tokens that you earn uh, for leveling up the full set of gear and turning it in, so it's not. Yeah, this doesn't. It doesn't generate any of it uh, but the nice thing is that the glows don't cost anything and they go across the line uh, which means you can use them for all of your characters it's not just one it's unlocked for the whole set um, ignore that um, I don't do raids uh, I don't do nightfall strikes I am pretty much the solo player solo player doing the solo contents uh, but we're gonna hit up this one first brief awoken are weird like that he assured me it was a gold mine so I went exploring check near some kind of generator machine thing should be one I haven't hit in years so it kind of giving you a little heads up that it is in a uh, uh, in and near and around a generator. Hmm. Let's go ahead and find that. I like having the third person view like this. Especially when I'm running around searching for things. Uh, as I'm just running around this way, I do see it. It's literally right here. Uh, I ended up getting arm, a gun, and some tokens. 
hear them in the background. Very loud. Uh, this one. So I chase the gangs of awoken thieves up the archaeology. That bridge didn't didn't look too stable. I'm just not into methane baths, so I stashed what I had and picked up their trail inside. That's one that I haven't done. So that one is new to me. Um, what seems like it's going to be in a section before the bridge because it's not on this side of it so my thought is that it's on the other side right there literally just kind of turn around and hit the corner I uh, got a power weapon shotgun looks like uh, and uh, four more tokens Pull up another one. Uh, this one. What idiot crashed the tank into the wall? It definitely, 100%, absolutely, wasn't me. You believe me, right? You can kind of see the little glowy thing right there. That's literally where we're heading. So, as we kind of hop over these... see the light we're gonna go to the right of it just kind of jump on there and onto the back uh, I got a one mod and four more tokens like usual you're always gonna find four tokens in these things pull up our map find the next one uh, it's gonna be this one this one is in some kind of wall what was it with golden age that they built walls around everything. Now the wall that they're insinuating is this thing here. Not the, not the crane. This thing right here. This is considered to be a wall. Uh, and that's what he's, re that's what he's referring to. Um, it's kind of odd that he would say it. Like it's hidden in a wall when it's, you're looking for like a hole in a wall. Excuse me. As I just kind of run into you. Uh, this one I'm going to run in, grab it, and then run through the other side. Because it's out in the open. And we're going to try not to kill things. Uh, got an exotic engram. And a perfectly normal coin. With four tokens. So I got an exotic engram, which is nice. Now, also nice, they don't come through those walls. All right, so this last one. Maybe I'll move a little bit away. It'd probably be able to shoot me, but eh, we're not worried about that. Uh, you know what I used to love about my rest stops on Titan? Walking into the archaeology and thinking about it in its heyday. But then you get to thinking of how much we actually lost and how the hive just spawning everywhere. And the will to fight boils right back up. So that one uh, was off on the right in here. Uh, it literally isn't too far. Uh, kind of should be seeing it, actually. Right there. So these ones were actually nice, tight nip. Uh, this is Destiny 2 Treasure Hunt Tuesday for Xbox. I'm going to go back into this corner. As we count out, because we spent 24,000 Glimmer. Spent 24,000 Glimmer. Uh, and I have... Oh, I'm going to go... Yeah. Let's go back and find out what my exotic engram is. I know I'm not going to get any Glimmer back from it. Um... That was very weird timing. Uh, I know I'm not going to get any glimmer back from it, so it, it's not it, it's not too big of a deal, but let's try to figure it out. Um, so I got this, which is 100, 200, 
300. 400. Uh, I got mods. Alright. Two mods. Uh, and I don't. Oh, and one coin, which is 500. So I got 500 out of 200. Uh, 24,000 glimmer. Uh, that's not very much coming back. So it's. It does seem like a, a waste this time. Uh, I really would have preferred an exotic uh, for a chance at that hard light that I've been struggling to try and get since ever. <laughs> uh, I think I got hard light randomly by chance in Destiny 1. Very, very, very late game. I feel like this is going to be the same thing when they're getting ready to launch Destiny 3. Here you go, here's Hard Light, and they've nursed it, they've changed it, so uh, that's something that is going to irritate me. And I keep on hoping for Xur to have it, of which Xur is no longer alive right now because it's Tuesday. I was going to say, and what does he have? Pop him in here. Uh, I think Faction Rallies might be live. Nope, that was, I thought that was faction rallies. Uh, but there is this thing, uh, Cade's Spicy Ramen, um, that you can do. Uh, it, <clears throat> you have two weeks to do that one, uh, which I am not, I'm not pleased about that they're giving you such short amount of time for it. Um, I feel like that should have been a month. Uh, the Solstice should have been at least two months. Uh, in order to figure things out, get time in, especially for us weekend warriors like me uh, that don't necessarily have the time to grind it out day in and day out. Uh, go over here and unlock that one item. Find out what it is what that we got. I have no idea. You tell me. Just a regular old kinetic weapon is an auto rifle uh it is a pretty high high end auto rifle with 720 fire rate that's uh sweet business being i do need to zero out my stick look at that yeah i thought i did that's me flicking it up, and then it just trickles down a little bit. Uh, so I'm going to hold on to that, test it out later. Uh, I appreciate you guys for watching. Uh, I do have... Uh, I do have two things uh, to kind of go over here real quick. Uh, number one, uh, I am doing a charity event for the month of August until the... Hold it back up. Uh, until the 28th, so I have one more week for this charity event. Uh, I'm gonna try to get uh, We're trying to figure and plan stuff out uh, for uh, a good time to do the charity bash Throughout uh, I've been kind of not fully Going all out going come charity uh, So but here it is uh, it is chive charities chive charities is putting on an event amongst other charity events uh, that is thechive.com. Uh, does charity events like this. Uh, I am, uh, it's a bunch of teams going, uh, trying to, you know, charities battling against, uh, seeing who can raise the most. I'm going for stackup.org. Now, stackup.org is an organization that strives to bring video game and video game paraphernalia to those that are active duty and wounded, uh, uh, and wounded veterans and soldiers alike. Video games for all that we know uh, and have uh, actually been backed by science that it helps reduce PTSD, uh, decrease depression, lowers anxiety, and boosts morale. So those are four great things that definitely our troops uh, need, uh, especially those that have been wounded. Um, I know a couple guys that uh, they have said that the video games have actually brought them brought joy back into their life uh, after being wounded from being soldiers. I never thought that they'd play video games, so they went back into it and they started playing. So there's a little bit on stackup.org. Um, 
there will be a link for uh, that in the description below. Also, uh, for those that follow my live streams on Twitch, I'm doing a giveaway uh, for you guys especially. Uh, the link is going to be below, but you can also check out my Twitter uh, for it. Um, it is a Gleam giveaway. Uh, it's a $25 gift card for those that follow me on Twitch. Uh, it is a thank you uh, for reaching 100 followers on Twitch. I appreciate it. Every little bit counts, and so I'm giving back. It's a $25 gift card for PlayStation, Xbox, Nintendo eShop, or Steam. Any one. Uh, it is winner's choice, uh, so I'm not going to sit there and kind of prevent anyone from getting it. Uh, the announcement and the end date for that is uh, Tuesday the 11th of September. I know that wasn't a bad, that was uh, kind of a bad thought to have it end on Tuesday the 11th. That wasn't my intent. It just kind of fell in that I wanted to give a full 30 days for everyone for have a chance to enter get there uh, and uh, do it that way um, that is it for destiny 2 treasure hunt Tuesday don't forget to like subscribe follow uh, I am the mecha man t-h-e-m-e-k-k-a-m-a-n the mecha man you can follow me on twitch twitter instagram facebook and youtube have a great one I enjoyed doing this and hopefully they will still have Kid Six Treasure Hunt Tuesday or something similar after Forsaken, uh, we won't know. I will find out with everyone else and I will definitely share it and let everyone know. Thank you so much. Peace.